Everyone in this room, everyone in this country, and everyone on this planet deserves to find their true happiness. Today on World Mental Health Day, I am ready. I'm ready to dedicate, I'm ready to advocate and listen to you for those struggling with mental illnesses. Because if we work together, we can achieve the universe that we can proudly say, this is the real me. Thank you. เลยค่ะ speech wild card นะคะ M U T 97ค่ะ Amanda c h a l i s a of them Jet Amanda c h a l i s a of them Real you is not about but every one of us It's about speaking up and listening to one another For greater change. สำหรับเรียลเฮอร์เพราะว่าได้คิดว่ารูปนี้เนี่ยมันสะท้อนถึงอะไรหลายๆอย่างรูปนี้ด้ากําลังรําไทยให้คุณแม่ดูอยู่นะคะก็มันทําให้เห็นว่าด้าเนี่ยได้เติบโตมาในวัฒนธรรมไทยและได้มีคุณแม่ที่เป็นคนไทยที่สอนสิ่งไทยๆให้ด้านะคะจะบอกตรงนี้เลยว่าหัวใจด้าไทยมากค่ะและด้ามาอยู่จุดตรงนี้เนี่ยพร้อมที่จะเป็นตัวแทนของคนไทยที่จะไปคว้ามงสาค่ะ MUT 97 Amanda ค่ะ Amanda ค่ะอยากให้เราถามเป็นภาษาอังกฤษหรือภาษาไทยคะภาษาอังกฤษค่ะ Oh she wants in English make our job just a little harder huh Okay ค่ะ All right so here you go Amanda a hundred years from today who would have historians select As the most influential woman in the 21st century, and why? Please show your real vision. Go. So, if you ask me who I choose as the most powerful woman, I think all of us are the most powerful woman because us women we are so strong and we're so powerful. And if we put our mind into something, we can do it just as hard. Thank you. ถามว่าในอนาคตท่านเลือกผู้หญิงคนไหนเป็นผู้นำได้อแมนด้าคะอแมนด้าอยากได้ภาษาอังกฤษหรือภาษาไทยคะ You want Thai English Okay English Okay ค่ะอแมนด้าเอาภาษาอังกฤษเลยครับอแมนด้า get ready for this The picture of Temple of Dawn has always been taken to symbolize Thailand's spirit and landmark If you become the new Miss Universe Thailand in what way Would you represent yourself as one of the new iconic of Thailand? Please show your real vision. Let's go. If I were to represent Thailand, honestly, I would just show everyone myself, because I often get critique of being half half Thai, half Canadian. But what I want to say here today is, I am Thai. 
I was born to a Thai mother and I couldn't have been more Thai. So I want to show you all of me, all of my Thai-ness, because I am Thai. Thank you. All right, Amanda! Miss Universe Thailand 2020, Daika! I've always been fascinated of the elegance of playing chess. My heart beats for that Eureka moment when I finally figure out the right move. I am Rubia Mateo, and in my heart, I am an athlete. Miss Iloilo City, Miss uh, Rabia Mateo, how are you? I'm doing great. I feel like I'm one step closer from having my first national crown. Well, you are actually. You are in the top 16. So let's see how it goes with this. Um, this comment here. You have 30 seconds to answer this. Throughout this journey, you have discovered that you are a phenomenal woman who is conditioned for greater. How can you create a positive and lasting impact to the world around you? Your time starts now. First of all, I need to stick to my core, which is being passionate about educating people. I am a lecturer and I've been pursuing this because 
this education had helped me to have that comfortable life that I and my family deserves. And I want to push people. I want to... Uh, I want them to achieve greater things in life through me. And I know with Miss Universe, anything is possible because I am a phenomenal woman with a heartfelt beauty. Thank you very much, Miss Ula Ula City, Rabia Mateo. Next. Elo Elo City, Rabia Mateo. Congratulations, and now it is time for us to find our final contest. You guys are all winners. This has been a great experience. Very, very powerful Filipino women. Congratulations. Our top five finalists are bracing themselves for the toughest round of the competition because next up, is the question and answer segment with a twist. That's coming right up. Let's call on Ilo Ilo. Rabia Mateo. Good evening. 
Good evening, Casey. How are you doing? I'm nervous. <laughs> For everybody. Okay. <laughs> So I will ask you two questions. You're okay. able to choose a number backstage. After you uh, talk for 30 seconds, you will hear this. And then I will ask another question where you receive another 30 seconds. Okay. Clear? Yes. All right, here we go. Your first question. If you could create a new paper currency with the image of any Filipino on it, dead or alive, who would it be and why? If I were given the chance, I want to use the face of Miriam Defensor Santiago. For those who don't know, she was an Ilonga, but what I admired about her is that she used her knowledge, her voice to serve the country. And I want to be somebody like her, somebody who puts her heart, her passion into action. And after all, she is the best president that we never had. Okay, it's time for your second question. This pandemic has made clear our priorities, essential or non-essential. Where do pageants stand in this time of crisis? As a candidate, I know I'm not just the face of Iloilo City, but I am here carrying hope and as a symbol of light in the darkest times. And as of the moment, I want to help my community. I want to use my strength to make an impact. And that is the essence of beauty pageant. It gives us the power to make a difference. Well said, Ilo Ilo. Rabia Mateo. Next up, let's see Ilo Ilo, Rabia Mateo. Thank you so much, Ilo Ilo. Our fourth runner up is. Cavite! The third runner up is. The second runner-up is... Quezon City! Only two remained. Let me remind you that in case the winner fails to fulfill her duties and obligations, the first runner-up will take over as Miss Universe Philippines. I will announce the name of the winner first. That means the other contender is our first runner-up. Ladies, take a deep breath. It is time for the moment of truth. Miss Universe Philippines 2020 is...
Miss Universe 2020.